And you take a look at this recent removal, uh, resignation, they are calling it, of the president of Nickelodeon. Uh, what do you guys make of that? She's been president since 06, but she's been at the network for the last 30 years, and suddenly she's out. Well, you know, obviously, and we've been seeing this since we started uh, doing going into the whole Schneider thing and Nickelodeon thing, people have been quietly been removed. Uh, and they do take time between each removal. Uh, I think that from what we've read that maybe some people are absolutely complicit, knew what was happening. And if you look up Dan Schneider, he was a cash cow for the network. Right. That every show he pitched was greenlit immediately and it made a lot of money. And I think when it comes down to it, that's what it was about. It was about keeping the keeping the train rolling. Uh, I think what is also kind of disturbing is that Dan Schneider left and uh, you would think somebody with such a pedigree, you know, with somebody who's written so many successful shows would be picked up and hired immediately sure. by somebody else. But it's almost like there's something toxic about him and nobody wants to touch him. Yeah, you're telling me Disney won't at least have a meeting with the right. guy. You know what I mean? It's a little weird.